Alrighty. So we do have a, a whole load of gold, 15,000, which is more than we'll ever need probably at this point. We're going to do the optional quest here. It's uh, destroy the green mana, so let's go down. This is a full-fledged mission, it seems so. With the orcs and goblins running rampant in the Eastern Empire, valuable forces are being drawn away from the defense of Talibai. If the horde can be destroyed or scattered, the Empire's defenders can concentrate on the army of the Demon Prince. Well, let's do it then. The two heroes, definitely taking the healing mage. Um, archers, check. Get one repeater bolt. Excuse me, I said get one. At least get the one with the armor upgrades, there we go. These also don't have armor upgrades, so these are guys are recent. I think these are the ones that were defending the, uh, at least these two. Maybe they were defending that pillar. Uh, let's get a second series of archers. And then we have shadow warriors, I'll take those. We have more archers, I'll take them. Then we have the white lions and the sword masters of Hoeth. I'm not going to take the other ones. Right, um, level up. They did level up a little bit. So, Flames of the Phoenix. And then the Light Mage. Definitely get the healing spells. Heals and resurrects recently dead friendly High Elves uh, and Empire units within the target area. Last 60 seconds. Or 10 heals plus resurrects. Plus um, 2 charges per level. So that's 20 charges. Insane. It's just insane right there. Let's go kill some orcs. Orcs are tough fighters. If not the most disciplined, but they... Uh, but they can co uncoordinate and easily disrupt it. Right, so orcs are tough fighters, if not most disciplined. But they can be uncoordinated and easily disrupted. Alright. The expansion of this game, Battle March, which I also have. It's a gold. I bought the gold edition. You'll be playing as these guys. These weren't in the original uh, Mark of Chaos. They were as enemies, but not as a playable race. Alright. Um, let's set up Aurelian with a bunch of archers. This Light Mage with a bunch of archers. So archers, 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 archers. This will be Team 1. You guys will be team two, my defenders. You guys. And then the bolt thrower. What, are they going to attack me or what? What's that? Outpost. I don't really trust these hills. Let me go to the hills first. I should have probably got that eagle. It's a pretty good scout. Oh, they're attacking me, actually. All right. Defensive positions, sort of. Oh, there's more of them here. Oh crap, the bolt thrower is kind of out in the open. What's this? Is this gold? Yeah. Got some orc. What are these biggins? Orc boys. They're after my uh, artillery. Archers, pull loose, knock, go away, get them. How many? They got two hit points. These are the tough guys. Not tough enough though. 
Go away. I like this shit of warriors. What are you guys trying to do? Where are you going? Orc Arr boys. Okay, archers. I think they'll be after my uh, bolt thrower. Oh, they're charging and quickly fire. There we go. We broke them. Are these guys still stealthed? No, they are not. So it's 13 archer boys versus a buttload of elves. There's more. They're com they're coming in slowly. More orc boys and more orc boys, okay. Two more boy, uh, orc troops. Oh, and there's a war boss. Many foes will be slain. Maybe if they all came at once, they might have stood a chance, but now they're just getting picked off one by one. <laughs> you is gonna get it right chopping. Hey, I never agreed to a melee combat. Not cool, man. Not cool. Why would I agree to a duel? Can I disengage? I can. Stop engaging me in melee combat. You are super annoying, you know that? We can just kill you like this, no problem. I don't care about honorary combat, where else? We're sneaky. There you go. Go away, you. There's another one. Get the freaking items, come on! Why are you taking so slow? Why? I mean, why are you taking so long? <laughs> oh, they're, they were like literally fleeing. No. Is that it? I didn't know when I selected flee, they literally flee. Okay, it seems there's more. That's good to know, and good to remember as well. The units, when they flee, they literally flee. But like, you know, they do a step back. No, they run across half the field. Didn't actually lose a lot of units, it's just that these units can, uh, they leveled up. Right, so there are still more units. <clears throat> 
Let me heal up my uh, white lions first. Right now they're just healing, it seems. That's okay. They're white lions. They should be able to handle these. Especially being backed up by half the entire population of elven archers. Yeah, these guys are getting slaughtered. What do we got here? Goblins. What is my mission? Do I need to destroy the camp? The tents, okay. These guys don't stand a chance. I don't think they'll even be within range to attack. So it's a green skin army because it's a combination of goblin and orcs. Didn't really see that that much during uh, Shadow of the Horned Red and Warhammer Dark Omen. It was either orcs or goblins, not a combination. Not much at least. Still my white lions didn't heal. I mean they healed but they didn't replenish. You go here. You go here. I'm gonna split up my forces a little bit. Just to see if there's any goodies laying around. Not even sure if there's any enemies. There might nothing there might be nothing here. <clears throat> Which seems to be the case. Well, that's gold. That's uh they kept that. They kept the fact that you can pick up gold with any unit. It was the same as Shadow of the Horned Red and Warhammer Dark Owen. Oh, so we still have enemies here. Alright. It's just one I could probably take them down. Just goblins, anyway. There we go. They're already dead. Just a few arrows and a well-placed uh, lightning bolt, or whatever it's called. Took them down already. What is that spell called, anyway? Wrath of Cain. Looks like an ice ice bolt or something. We have a few tents here. Don't want to destroy these yet because it will end the mission. And I kind of would like to see here first. Can you guys run? Most of them are out of energy, actually. Alright, that seems all. Yeah, 
Gonna move my heroes in pretty, uh, pretty close. Can you heal them, please? There. So if they drop an item, we can pick it up. Or Avalon. Or Avalorn. That's actually a really good item. Not that we don't net not that we need it anymore with this light mage, but I have the power to destroy cities. The ammo you make me with a miracle shed a ray of light. I should have moved in a little bit closer before I destroyed it. Come on, run. Yeah, I knew it. That was my mistake. You only have about like 10 seconds before the mission ends once you complete your objective. We lost 9 units. They lost an entire army of greenskins. That was easy, guys. Chapter 4, the final stand. So uh, now we'll be going towards that village over there. And then I think we'll switch over to Stefan. From there on we will get one mission. Uh, crossroads, dual, optional. And then we'll meet together in the, uh, in the city. Another 10k. We don't need that much gold anymore, really. Near the Teleback Muster. The Empire is in a tumultuous state, but warriors are being mustered from all over. Preparing to strike back the Chaos forces advancing on Telebime. While Stefan van Kessel is en route to mustering a Telebime, he encounters a vanguard of the Chaos Horde led by a diabolical sorcerer of Nurgle. Alright, so we cannot go to this camp yet, unfortunately, which I was kind of hoping we could. Let's at least heal up my units. I don't think we lost that much. We got way plenty of gold. We got too much gold, actually. White Lions also leveled up. They're a little bit expensive. Now we'll switch to Stefan. I will actually want to check out Stefan because he's got this new look. Uh, sorry, here, his new look. But I also know that he has a new weapon. This is a sort of Mandrith. Then there's 30% chance to hit plus 20% attack speed, which is actually pretty good. This is the other one, Rune Fang. One damage and ignores armor. That might be even better. So it's 78 and 40. How much does this one do? 60 and 33. So on that point you'd think he'd do less. Sigil of Sigmar. The wearer gets 10% HP while he wears this amulet. That's a lot of HP, man. What does the uh, necklace do again? Melee damage resistance. I think I'll take the 10 HP. Thank you very much. Let's start tossing over some items. Okay, he already got, has good items. Let's go to Gunther. Gunther, take the Sword of Mandrit. Armor and magic resistance. Units of Unbreakable. Let me give that to the Knight's Panther. I want this to go... Actually, the Dwarves already have a banner. But I think that's a good banner for the Dwarves. The Unbreakable, perfect. Um, give this to the Captain. Give this to the Captain. Give this to the Captain. The Captain is my duelist. 
Give that to the captain. Give that to the captain. He's got Worm Slayer Sword. Righteous Steel, 25% chance to hit. Okay, that one's better. 10% shooting damage, and... Oh, okay, I'll go with that one. And then we have a Warhammer and this thing. Alright. I'm just gonna check if any of these units have uh, abilities to spend. These guys, this guy has four of them. Alright, Gunther. Then we got uh, Jade Wizard. He has three of them. Then we got the Captain... Zero, and we got Stefan. Zero. Alright. Well, guys, in the next mission, we'll do the uh, Horde of Decay. So I'll see you guys then. Till then.